Unforeseen Primate here. I want to welcome you to our very first installment of Movement Detail. Today we're going to be going over the double jab cross on the step ladder drill. This drill starts at ends in your boxing stance. As you can see it here, I am a natural southpaw, so you'll see that my right leg is in front of my left, always starting and ending in this position. And since most of the world is right-handed, you would simply switch this position having your left foot in front of your right foot. For our first step, we're going to line up to the next box by taking a little baby step over to the left with our left. Why move with our left foot? Because we don't want to cross our feet when we're moving laterally. Now that we have ourselves lined up, we're going to go ahead and step forward and jab at the same time. Notice how our stance here gets a little bit wider. This is exactly what we're looking for. As our back step follows our front step, our jab comes in, putting us back into our neutral boxing stance. Now we're going to go ahead and repeat the very same sequence of stepping forward and throwing the jab at the same time, putting us back in that nice open boxing stance. Now we're going to follow up with the back leg stepping into the box. Let's go ahead and pause here for a second. We need to point out a few things. For starters, we have followed up our second jab with the cross up at the top. And the proper way to follow through with that is that we've driven our hip forward towards our opponent. You can see now that it's squared up towards the bag, transferring power from the ground through our body to our punch. Only one last thing to complete our sequence. We simply step back, leading with our back leg, and start the rep all over. Have fun, my friends.